Hey, hi all. In this video, we will discuss about which security enforced keyword uh, which we use in SOQL queries to check whether a particular user has field level uh, access to the fields which uh, which they are uh, which they are trying to access or which they are trying to get data from using uh, the query. So let's start. First, Apex generally runs into system context, which means uh, that it does not take into consideration the current user's permissions and field level security. This causes a problem because if you include a field in in a SOQL query that a user doesn't have access to, the field is returned and can be used by the code, thus exposing the data to someone that should not have access to it and they can see the data eventually so we use with security enforced keyword to throw an exception if there are any fields or objects in the query that the context user doesn't have access to previously what we were doing uh, we were uh, we were checking or we were checking the accessibility of the field using schema function uh, as it's mentioned before before to with security enforced keyword we use to check field level security like below so in this if you can see there is an if condition and in that if we have a subject type account the name then we are defining like all the fields and then which field we are looking in the name field if the name field is accessible for the particular user which has run this code or in that transaction then only this particular query will run otherwise it will not run because there is that and logic like the name field should be accessible the phone field should be accessible then only we will run this query to get uh, the name and the phone or to get all the records which are accessible to that particular user the running user the that that records will be returned and then we can process further this records according to the logic now what has been changed we just need to add with security enforced keyword that is this with security enforced keyword in soql to query the code so in the try if you see we have created a list of account and then we are only getting name and phone from account and we have used with security enforced keyword it means that if a particular running user don't have access to phone or to contact uh, or to phone field or to name field, then this particular try block will not execute and it will go to the catch and this exception will be there. You don't have access to all the fee account fields because this particular record which they are returning as of now the user might have access to that particular record but user doesn't have access to name or phone field of account object so uh, this is the main uh, reason this with with uh, sorry, with security enforced keyword it was introduced into soql so when we are writing the code to check whether the particular user has access to all the fields which are defined in that query, if we are uh, if we are using with security enforced, we can easily check whether a particular user has access to all the fields or not. Then uh, another thing which comes into uh, picture is uh, the with sharing and without sharing keyword which we generally use while defining a particular class. So if a class <coughs> If a class is defined, if a class is defined with a keyword with sharing, so it might can on an object. For an example, on an contact object, it has access to five records, but this particular user doesn't have access to first name. First name on contact. So now if we are querying like select first name from contacts so we will get five records but this particular user doesn't have access to this particular uh, field first first name field of contact so if we are using with security enforced in this query then this will throw an error and uh, we will get to know like uh, this particular user doesn't have access to first name 
field of contact that's the reason it is failing and then we have to accordingly uh, we have to change our logic so uh, that's all regarding with security enforced and what uh, what is the difference between with security enforced and uh, the keywords with sharing without sharing with sharing without sharing are, is only for the record access whether a particular user has access to the records or not with security enforced we use in soql to check whether the, uh, whether uh, whether the fields which we are querying a user has access to them or not means like a particular field is accessible to the user or not that we can check using with security enforced keyword in soql query uh, thank you have a nice day